This morning, rescuers were busy pulling the elderly and infirm away from North Carolina's rising Cashy River and other waterways. Examples of how unpredictable the situation here really is. We always worry about it down here. Near the Outer Banks, a chartered jet hydroplaned off a runway and wound up in a river, but all aboard survived. And yet there are now seven confirmed weather-related fatalities in North Carolina, five yesterday and two today. And in Pennsylvania, a woman motorist died when her car slid off the road this morning. In King of Prussia, Pennsylvania, vehicles took on water and rescuers used rafts. Near Philadelphia, they needed second story evacuations because the first was underwater. In D.C. and Maryland, most of the 30,000 who lost power had it back this afternoon, but the worst is not over. We don't know exactly when we're going to be completely out of harm's way. Now, the good news is that the deluge was concentrated on the eastern seaboard, so the rainwater is mostly running off into the sea and not further threatening areas inland. Katie? All right, Dean Reynolds in Carolina Beach, North Carolina. Thanks very much, Dean.